guys, welcome back to my channel. Car's beeping at me as usual. I am heading out to the barn. It is a Wednesday morning before work and I am planning to practice my dressage test today. Now, I did not practice it on Sunday because I did a lot more jumping and it was really fun. Unfortunately, the people picked up, not me, but mainly everybody else. So I didn't get enough footage to make a video of me jumping. If I get any good clips, I'll put them in this vlog but otherwise it'll just be me running through the beginner novice, test, beginner novice test for the final time before we head to Lone Tree on Friday. So I'm gonna drive down now and get happy ready and hopefully we can do a final run through of the test and it'll look good. Um, today I'm gonna ride in my bit since the side pole is not dressage legal and I'm not really looking forward to it because I don't really like riding in my bit, but um, yeah, that's gonna happen today so that I'm prepared for riding in it on Saturday when we actually show. So anyways, I keep looking this way because I keep worrying my dogs are gonna run out the door and the gates open. But anyways, I will see you guys when I get to the barn. It was at this point in time that I realized Happy needed a little bit of a romp in the indoor arena before we rode. This would be the end of my tacking up and grooming part of the vlog and it would be the beginning of Happy running around like a lunatic for probably about 15 minutes before I was able to get his saddle on. So I captured 20 seconds of it and then went back and tacked him up when he was done. Okay, well round two of this, he uh, sprinted out of the cross ties to come down here to the indoor to run around like a dragon, as evidenced by the video you just saw. So I think he needed that, I think he had some built up tension, I think especially from getting, he had melanomas removed on his sheath, and they've been causing him a little bit of problem in the incision site. I think he had some tension in his back from that, so I think that this helped him. Unfortunately, oh shit, we forgot the, <laughs> yikes, I said shit. Oh, we forgot the uh, tripod. So we're going back now. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of time to ride now because I have to go to work. So I'm just gonna try to get our test in, see how that goes, since he's basically warmed up now. And then uh, be good from there. Oh, that was a rock. I was worried we were dropping something off of our tack. So hopefully this, uh, practice round of our Tesco as well and we could just be done with the day. Ah, they don't have very many rings for you to eat all of them. Have to do it this tight. You want to get on? You're gonna like let it all out, and then it's gonna be loose. Okay, don't hit the camera now. You know how you like to do that.
don't know who's rolling out there, but it's hella loud. So, um, I didn't do the whole test. I did parts of it. I think after him running around out here and it's already 9.20, I have to get work soon. I just wanted to do parts of it. Our camera transitions weren't great, but I'm hoping with an extra 12 feet of space, I will feel more comfortable getting those transitions and the circles. But I didn't really feel like it was really terrible today. I felt really good. I haven't ridden in a bit in like, since the show, so since like May. And he was really good. He was a little skeptical at first because he knows how I can get really grabby. And I think he was expecting that. But when I insisted that we go forward and he realized I was just gonna let him stretch into the bit, he was totally fine. And I felt like he rode super well. I barely had to use my hands at all. I used my seat. And the only times that we really had any issues was when this good old right seat bone was getting into him. Like here in this corner, he almost dived in because again, the right seat bone was right there telling him to. As soon as I straightened myself though, he was much better. So yeah, I, I'm feeling really good about this. Why is your mouth so gross? What did you get in there? Is this from the cookies? Can you see how gross this is? Look, it's gross. I gotta clean this again. But yeah, he was very good. Very good boy. So I think he gets one more just like little like stretch ride tomorrow. And then on Friday, we will do cross country schooling. And Saturday, we will do our test. And we'll do a great job, huh? Our goal is just to get through the test and um, that's it, honestly. I just wanna make it through the test, do most of the movements, if not all of them. And I don't care what we score at all. So that's kinda where we are right now. Um, I'm really excited about this. I'm not quite as nervous as I was for the um, pepper tree schooling show. So um, I think it's gonna be really, really fun and I'm really excited to go and to do some some eventing, huh? Where you going? Where you going? Oh, All right, so anyways, thanks for watching. Um, I will probably have maybe a helmet cam of our Friday schooling, and then obviously I'm gonna do a show vlog. So look forward to seeing those because I'm sure they'll be very exciting and action packed, right? And yeah, thanks you guys so much for watching.